Hey everybody, Caleb Dennison with Digital Trends. I'm at Samsung's booth again because we were made aware of the Samsung bot. In total, there's three different robots that Samsung has come up to address a number of different problems. The one that you see right next to me right now is the Samsung Care Bot. Now the idea with this is that it can provide home care for the elderly, the infirmed, or well, really just about anyone. It can take your blood pressure, it can monitor your vitals, uh, it can monitor your sleep and tell you how your sleep went that last night. It can deliver your medication. It allows caregivers to interact with their patients while they're at home without actually having to be there. And that's just the beginning. They have a whole bunch of different home care ideas set up for this robot. And though it's not an actual product yet, we do expect that it will be one about this time next year. Now there's also the Samsung AirBot. This is basically a roving air cleaner. So let's say you burnt the cookies and your kitchen is full of smoke. The Samsung AirBot will move into the kitchen, clean the air, and come and give you a clean air report when it's done. It can also move room to room and clean the air in any of the rooms in your home that it can access. And finally, there's the Samsung Retail Bot. Samsung has this in mind for various retail outlets and uh, food dispensaries. So let's say you go to a restaurant, it can roam right up to you show you what's on the menu, you can order, it'll bring it to you, and you can pay the robot right there. No need to interact with the server if you don't want to. But I think a more practical application is in one of Samsung's stores. The demonstration they showed here today was one which uh, the Samsung bot came up to a customer, recognized that they were wearing a Samsung Galaxy watch, and then made some accessory uh, suggestions for it based on what it was wearing. And again, you could select that item, the bot could bring it to you, and then you could pay using the robot. These are some some very futuristic ideas that are coming to fruition right now. We could see these things as early as next year. That's Caleb Dennison at the Samsung booth at CES 2019. Check out the bots and we'll see you on the next one.